Mr. Riley, he's a big, big baby, big, big lover. First, when you're introducing a dog to a new environment, is that for him it's a new context. He doesn't know that all the rules that we've been practicing over the last week and a half apply here. So the first thing I want to do is make sure that I don't let him get away with anything. Even teeny little things, I want to make him really, really clean. That way his first association with being here isn't, oh, I get to do whatever I want. <laughs> Off. Good job. Sit. Good boy. And right there, I see him seeing the dog. I'm gonna tell him what I want him to do with it. I'm gonna make sure that I'm preparing him for that dog by saying sit, off. And this is where not caring what the number is really matters too. Because I would have assumed after last group class that he might be in TCM. But right now he's at 10 TVM and, it, and, it's, and he's getting the message. And so never rely on what you think the number is. Yeah. Off. Come. Heel. Off. Yeah, we're not quick enough with that. Off. That I'm telling you. Yeah, the prevention is key there. Yeah. Sit. Off. Sit. Good job. Off. Sit. Good job. Good job. Good boy. Those are very animated dogs. Those are dogs that he wants to go see. <laughs> Sit. She's not jumping three feet in the air like yeah. before. <laughs> yep. Yeah, sometimes she, he would go up this high and almost rip my shoulder out. <laughs> yeah, I remember that first time. I came to your place. Yeah, well, he's doing fantastic. <laughs> Good job. Heel. I just want to get him in a heel, yeah. and then I'm going to pass him back off to you guys, but I really want to get him doing all of the obedience here. Off. I know that's your dad. Good job. I think might have just had to take you off. <laughs> 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 off. Sit. Good boy. Good job. Heel. Off. Heel. Off. 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 Off.
Good job. Sit. Alright. But see how I'm trying to get him away from needing the leash tension? So that's why I only have the end of it. And I'm using this to suck him into me. And then that whole doing the opposite of whatever he's doing wrong. So if he starts to go that way, I'm kind of I'm turning around. If he gets ahead, I'm flipping around. Come. Off. Heel. Good job. Off. Come. I know you love your papa. I know. I know. Sit. Down. he got yeah. you know and that was and he didn't want to come to me he was fixated he was turned that way but I said it the one time button button come up button button come up and then eventually it broke his concentration and he went all oh, right okay and that's that's the difference between pulling him past something and actually working him through it you know I got him to decide to turn around and come back to me I'm gonna tell you, if you feel like you need a button, button. I'm also going to try to say it. <laughs> now, you could probably come down a couple. Now, there's a big thing when you switch handlers, it's really stressful for him to walk with me with you guys over here because you're a distraction. But now, we're gonna be going to only you as a distraction instead because both me and you are gonna be walking with him. So immediately his noise level for this situation might be a little lower than it just was. So you could always default to coming a couple down when you're switching handlers. Like he'll probably work at the lowest level with you because he already associates you with walking and healing and obedience. Um, so you always want to default to going a little bit lower because we would rather have it too low and have to come up than too high and have a traumatic experience. Say come and then button, button, button. Use a little bit of leash tension towards you. <laughs> Off. All right. Off. Look at him, he's kind of scooching slowly. <laughs> come. Good job, boy. <laughs> but see how in that moment it took a little bit of patience and a little bit of trust in the system? A little time to Yeah. Cause he's trying to figure it out. Uh -huh. Button, button, button. Off. Off. Keep walking. Keep walking. Off. Off. Every time you see his head swivel, look down, look up. Off. Button, button. Button, button. Just hit the button. He's 
because he's such a lover, such a, he's such an attached dog. Whenever you guys tell him to sit or down, it's typically near you. And he's picking up on that pattern. So anytime you say sit or down, he's doing it on you instead of where he is. Yeah. Come. Sit. Good boy. Off. Yeah. <laughs> now go see your mama. 